All right, so eventually I'll have those bikes and those bikes on the wall. And then I can just go in and out through here. Sick. I'm loving my new office setup. And I'm loving this even more. Just had a, uh, a nice little breakfast, but I forgot how much fun it is just to ride the mountain bike around. Around the streets. I wanted to show you guys the Strava Cycling Maven Squadra. We're gonna start regularly checking people's scores on maybe Fridays and, and uh, Sundays at the end of the week and uh, see if we can start giving away a few prizes. So this is it, Cycling Maven Squadra. So we've got 221 members on the Cycling Maven Squadra. That was the best name I could come up with at the time. So uh, bear with me on that. We may change that. But uh, yeah, look, last week's leaders, Charlie Beak took out the distance with 497 kilometers. Eddie Eel did a 206 kilometer ride, which is pretty amazing, huge ride. Big K's, boys, big K's, bit of, cl oh yeah. 4,600 metres, Eddie, go for it. Thanks for coming. Does a 206-kilometre ride and does 4,600 metres of elevation. Sweet as. So how's Eddie going this week? He doesn't look as though he's... I don't know. Can't find him. But anyway, Lewis Bull is leading this week on 137 kilometres. He's done four rides and it's only Tuesday. Awesome riding, dude. So what we'll do is we will start to look at this more regularly and we uh, and eventually i'll start getting uh sponsors people who want to send me stuff we will give away some prizes or we could even partner with some brands and we'll start giving away some prizes for uh you know maybe i don't know maybe monthly distance longest ride climb look let's let's discuss it in the comments below uh you guys always come up with some great ideas and we can probably do some prizes based on uh, on this, on, on, on maybe climbing, maybe monthly distance or monthly climbing or whatever. But anyway, let me know in the, in the comments and uh, we'll go from there. All right, vlog is almost done. I am almost done. I am not walking around the house with my helmet on. I am going down to catch up with a mate, have a break from editing, have a coffee with him. Weather's still pretty nice here in Melbourne at the moment. It's quite balmy. There he is. Good legend. How are you? living in now Alstonwick is a very very Jewish area which is which is great because they do great food and they're good people but it's not often you see a van with music playing out of it like that and they can't drive to save their lives to Jewish Check out the <laughs> so seriously since I last spoke to you maybe 10 minutes has passed these guys still haven't parked the car. Should I go and park it for him? Yeah, what? Should I go and park it for him? I'll Definitely. ask him. Go on, mate. <laughs> he has done an Austin Powers. <laughs> He's better than you guys. He's better than you guys. 
a good seven minutes and he's still going. There's been about 10 toots. The tram was held up for a couple of minutes. He's tried three times. I'm pretty sure he's given up now and he's gone up up there. So. He has finally parked and this van is full of humans, like literally full of humans. See ya, Broseph. Take it easy. Good to see you, mate. Good human. Good human. You know it. Yeah, caught up with AC, absolute legend. But the food took about 45 minutes to come out, so I thought I gotta, I gotta get going. It's uh, such a nice afternoon right now. I'm gonna go down and check out the beach. Absolutely beautiful. That lady back there was laughing at me. But uh, yeah, I'm really close to the beach these days, so it's pretty cool. The other thing, it's really nice to be back on top of the vlogs. I uh, had a bit of a break there for about four days while I was moving house, but I got one out just then, so I'm stoked. For those not from Melbourne, this is this is called Br Brighton, but uh, it's quite a rich area, so they call it. I don't know how to say it properly, but I think it's Brighton, Br Brighton, Brighton. You got to lag out the eye. Absolutely cracking sunset down here at the beach. It's just it's beautiful. Just a beautiful time of day. And the good thing about Melbourne is I can now go do a bunch ride. There's a bunch ride that leaves at 6.30 from just down the road from my house. So beautiful down here, honestly. Oh well, I'm going to do the bunch ride. Right, this is coming into the last maybe 400 meters of the Tuesday night championships, which is a really nice beach ride going down beach road. Sorry about the grainy footage. I was trying out some new settings on my um, GoPro. Turned the ISO right up to 1600. Made it really grainy. But yeah, we're just coming into the final section. We always have a little friendly sprint. You can see we're doing 48 k's an hour. I'm at 183 beats a minute, so I'm definitely in the hurt house. Um, <clears throat> all the crew jump. We just have a little friendly sprint just up here, providing it's all pretty safe. And there's three lanes, so you can see the whole bunch just jumps here. Guys are just going left, right, and centre. Kicked up to 800 watts there, 54 kilometres an hour. So I'm trying to get out here, just trying to find a little path, jump across to this fella's wheel. Got some momentum, so I come over the top of him. 
jump on Troy Clark's wheel and look, lo and behold, he jumps out in front of me. Perfect timing. I'm second wheel coming into the sprint now, looking pretty, feeling great, thinking I'm going to come over him, but not a chance. The guy is just so powerful on the bicycle. He, I couldn't even come off his wheel. I couldn't even get around him. So lots of fun. I just got home from the ride. That was so fast. But Hanny's just cooked this pie. What is it? Mushroom pie? Mushroom pie. I'm going to cut it. Ready? Oh, that looks amazing. Are you serious? And what's in it? Mushrooms. Mushrooms? Yeah. Yeah. And a bit of potatoes. All right, you good humans. That is the end of the vlog for today. We will, um, I'm going to eat dinner, get an early night, get up early, edit this vlog, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.